Hello everyone. Um, today my subject is biochemistry, and I will explain you today. My topic is open chain form, open chain form defructose, from defructose convert into ring, make a alpha and beta structure. And you do know the structure of the fructose. This is the structure of the fructose. What is the molecular formula of the fructose? You know C6H12O6. C6H12O6. And you do know um, this is ketone. So that's why you have to lower the uh, double bond or ca ca carbon number. So that's why this is number 1. This is 2. This carbon is number 3. This is 4. This is 5. This is 6. Why? Because if you count from this from this side, is this double bond O carbon is very far so you, you have to lower in the number the carbon carbonyl group carbon you have to lower the number that's why if you count the other side it's going to be very closest okay right now you have to convert it to this one is what you have to convert these things is into the ring why because in in the cell inside the cell the glucose is not a open chain form this is what ring form okay so look right now what happened This is your carbon number one C CH two O H. This is your double bond O. Okay. This is your carbon number one. This is carbon number two. This is carbon number 2, this is carbon number 3. Look right now what happened. This is carbon number 3, this is carbon number 4, this is carbon number 5. Carbon number 5 is a what? Carbon number 5 is a 1 is OH. Another one is CH2OH and what? H. okay this is your basically this is your what this is um your um open chain form this is open chain form this is number one you see this is number one this is two this carbon is two this carbon is three this carbon is four this carbon is five and this carbon is six so look right now what happened this carbon is one bond is OH, one is H, one bond is H, one is OH. Okay. So you have to, okay. One thing you have to remember. What is the remember part? There is a one, one rotation is called muta rotation. The, there is a rotation. There is a rotation. This rotation is called a muta rotation. Muta rotation. And I will explain you why you need a muta rotation after uh, when I'll, I'll show the mechanism. Then I'll explain you why you need a muta rotation. Look right now what happened. And the formula is what um, ketone plus alcohol gives us intramolecular hemi ketal. Intramolecular hemi Keta. Look what happened. This two lone pair is going to be attached to this carbon. So this two lone pair oxygen, this two lone pair, this two lone pair from oxygen. What is the number from carbon number five? So it is carbon number five, hydroxy, oxygen attack to carbonyl group carbon carbonyl group carbon okay so carbonyl group carbon means what carbon number two is carbonyl group why double bond o is called nil so double bond o carbon is carbon number two this is carbon number two and these two lone pair attack to this carbon which number carbon number five oxygen is attacked to this carbon when this these two lone pair attack to this carbon, right now this carbon has a too many bonds. What happened? One bond is break up. 
when one bond is break up, what happened? Oxygen accept two electron. This is motion number two, and this is motion number one. Then you find you form like what? You form this is C C H two O H and Excuse me. When this one is attached to this one, it make a bond like that. And oxygen donate what? Uh, donate uh, two electrons oxygen become a positively charged and this oxygen except two electron become a negatively charged then what happened look these two lone pair these two lone pair is going to be attacked to this hydrogen attacked to this hydrogen and it gives us what it gives us When this this two lone uh, this negatively charged oxygen attack to this hydrogen, this hydrogen this bond is automatically break break down and oxygen accepted two electron. You see the accept accept two electron, and um, the plus sign is Benish. Uh, okay, so right now what happened? You find out your what your structure. There is one possible structure you can make it down how it is called muta rotation. I told you earlier what is the rotation is called muta rotation. You're going to be rotate this one. Then when you rotate this one, what happened? Look right now. After rotating your this one, when you rotate this one, look, I'm not I'm not drawing again in here. There's not a much space. So what happened? When you rotate this one, when you rotate, you're rotating this oxygen, double bond oxygen is going to be go higher. Go in the top and this CH2 is going to become. After muta rotation, after you're going to be rotate this one, this double bond O is going to be go to the top. Then is the same thing. This is going to be attack in here. This motion number one. Then this is breakdown. This is breakdown. Then what happened? When this is breakdown, what happened? Look. When this is breakdown. same thing and then these two lone pair again attack to this one this is what motion number one two this is motion number three and this is breakdown this is motion number four and you form what you form the structure is like that you form the structure
OH, H, H, O, H, C, H, 2, O, H and what? This is H. So, you make a two possible structure. You make what? Two possible structure and you don't know how you make because there is a, if you want to make a, this kind of structure, uh, you have to rot um, rotate this one the previous slide showed then if you want to make this one uh, if you want to make this one your structure has to be like that and uh, you make it this kind of structure and that kind of structure right now you have to tell me this is your which one is your alpha structure and which one is your beta structure so alpha structure and beta structure if you want to know you have to understand one things that carbon number um, carbon number two carbon number two this is my carbon number two this is my carbon number two carbon number two hydroxy hydroxy means oh carbon number two hydroxy oh and carbon number six is in the same side carbon number six means what carbon number six means one two three four okay one two three four five six carbon number six is in the same side if it's in the what side if it is in the same side that means what it gonna be it would be beta structure that means which one is the same side look right now this OH is carbon number 2 OH and this is carbon number 6 they are in the same side so they are in the same side means what this is called beta structure what kind of structure this is beta structure and beta structure and this one is they are in the opposite side that's why this is called what that's why this is called alpha structure this is called what structure alpha structure why because carbon number 2 OH carbon number 2 OH carbon number carbon number 2 OH and carbon number 6 they are in the opposite side carbon number 2 hydroxy and carbon number 6 they are in the opposite side that's why this is called alpha this is called what sorry alpha alpha structure right now you have to tell me the name of this one so how are you going to be named this one so I'll show you the one technique then you will not make a mistake you got you do know that What is the name of this one? This one name is called Furan, Furan or whatever, uh, F-U-R-A-N, Furan. So that's what, this is look like a Furan. You see that your, this structure and this one is the same kind of structure. So this is name is going to be, this one name is going to be Alpha, Alpha Fructo, Fructo Furanus. And this this one name is gonna this is beta structure so this one name is with beta fructo furanus furanus because of furan okay this this is the conversion from open chain de fructose to uh, a ring form and there is a two possible structure you can make alpha structure and beta structure and how you're going to be named based on furan because this is look like a furan so that's why this is called alpha fructo furanus and this is beta fructo furanus uh, why beta because of they are in the same side that's why this is beta and they are in the opposite side this oh and this carbon number six carbon is the opposite side that's why this is what that's why this is called alpha structure and I hope you guys like my videos. If you really like it, don't forget to share with your friend. And um, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any question, you can email me anytime. Um, I'll, I'll try to answer your question as soon as possible. And um, study hard. Hopefully see you in the next video. Oh, sorry, this is carbon number. Uh, this is three and this is four. This is the motion. This is the motion. Okay. Hopefully see you in the next videos and study hard. Thank you for watching my videos.